Welcome back to another console collector video. Hey everybody, console collector here. It's time for another round of recent pickups. Not too much in this video, but a few things that are pretty sweet so I want to share with, with everybody on the channel. First thing here is not this stack of PS1 games, but it's actually this unit here. It's a rotating CD display. I got for free from a garage sale. I thought it was a really cool way to display my PS1, Turbo Graphics, CDI, 3DO, Dreamcast, Mega CD32, etc. Sometimes it's the simplest things that you least expect that work out the best. So yeah, I wanted to show that first because it's kind of big and bulky. All right. Next thing I scored was the Days Gone Collector's Edition. Now this Collector's Edition here in Canada actually went on sale to $79.99 Canadian, which it was nearly $200 Canadian. So they're kind of clearing them out. And I thought, hey, what a great time to grab this bad boy. Haven't opened it yet, it's still sealed. So I'm gonna do an unboxing later on. I actually haven't even played the game yet, so now I have a sealed copy I can sell. So yeah, I'm pretty happy to get that collector's edition. Spin it back around. Alright, next up. I finally found the Majora's Mask for 3DS strategy guide. It's kind of the matching box. Or matching book with the treasure chest box set. The gold foil there. Legend of Zelda. Joe's Mask 3D Collector's Edition. It's got the gold pages on it. So yeah, very excited to finally get this. And it's sealed. Next up, I got the PAL version of The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker Limited Edition. Got the gold case, both games inside. It's complete. I really like this version of the collector's edition just because of the gold case. It's very Zelda-like. So happy to score that. At a garage sale, I actually found the Lion King soundtrack. And now you're probably thinking, why does anyone care about the Lion King soundtrack? This is the very first CD I ever bought when I was a kid. And I got it for a dollar at a garage sale. So, more nostalgic than anything. I got this PSP game, Death Junior 2 Root of Evil. Complete. I jumped on the bandwagon and got Hollow Knight. Still sealed, but I'm gonna crack it open and give it a go sometime. One of my co workers is obsessed with this game right now because it's awesome. Got a few non-video game things here, but I get in a garage sale for a buck. I got the Pokemon Legends movie collection, which has a bunch of Pokemon movies in it. Pokemon Forever, Pokemon Destiny Deoxys, Pokemon Jirachi, <clears throat> and Pokemon Heroes the movie. I actually haven't seen any Pokemon movies since number three with Entei. Well, my kids are really into Pokemon, so watch that with them. <clears throat> Next up, again, not really game related, but this is the original X-Men cartoon from like the 90s. And I got all five volumes. That's volume 5, volume 4, <clears throat> volume 3. I have these really cool slipcovers. <clears throat> Volume 2 and Volume 1. Any kid in the 90s uh, probably saw this show more than once. It's like the straight up like awesome X-Men cartoon. I really wish they did Spider-Man of that era on DVD. <clears throat> uh, some more garage sale finds. <clears throat> Excuse my voice. Got Knights of the Old Republic. It's not complete. It's got some scratches. It does work, but I paid a buck for it, so 
Couldn't leave it behind. This is a thrift store find for two bucks. Complete Ratchet and Clank Future. So again, two bucks for that. Got this for two bucks at a thrift store. Marvel Super Heroes. Complete. Uh, Lego. So looking forward to playing that with my older son. Another thrift store find. Two bucks for Doom 3 Steel Case. Complete. Got some uh, Wii and DS games here. Got Sonic Unleashed, complete for the Wii. Got Mad Dog McCree, Gunslinger Pack for the Wii. And I finally got Pokemon Conquest for DS, which is like a strategy Pokemon game. So, pretty happy about that. I haven't played it, but everyone says it's got like a Final Fantasy Tactics or Fire Emblem feel to it. I got a brand new limited run PS4 VR game, Prison Boss VR. Really looking forward to trying this out. I heard it's similar to Job Simulator. It was sealed. I actually opened it up today so I could stick the card in there. So looking forward to trying that out. Basically, you're a prisoner, I guess, and you're creating different things to survive and escape from prison, I believe. Got a couple of TV shows here I got recently. I got Inspector Gadget, Season 1, Volume 1. This is a show I watched when I was very young, around 4 or 5 years old, so pretty cool to grab that. I got this at a garage sale today, actually. It's the complete animated series of the Fantastic Four. All four discs. I didn't really watch too much of this back in the day, but I got this for two bucks, so couldn't say no. These are pretty cool. I'm excited about these. This is Gargoyles, the complete first season and season two, volume one. Gargoyles was another show I watched as a kid. So I was very happy to scoop these up from a thrift store. Next up is probably my favorite pickup this round. This is the complete series of Goosebumps. Yes, Goosebumps. Um, Are You Afraid of the Dark and Goosebumps were two of my favorite childhood shows. So I was super excited to finally get this. Now this is a PAL release only, unfortunately. So I did have to get a region free DVD player to watch it. Because for some crazy reason, this never came out in North America. As you can see there, PAL. But yeah, it's the complete series. So excited about this. I love this show as a kid. So, yeah. My favorite pick up this round. Oh. Now, I say the best for last. Which some of you that follow my Facebook, and you've seen these. I got these for a great deal. This is a sealed Xbox, original Xbox, hip gear controller with the built-in screen. That's right, sealed. Some of you may have seen my GameCube controller video uh, based on the GameCube controller with the screen, sorry. Uh, these are extremely rare controllers. They are third party, but yeah, they legit have a screen built in to the controller. Kind of like this. So you could play your console right on the controller. So yeah, original Xbox, sealed. I nearly had a heart attack when I saw that go up on Facebook Marketplace. And I did get the sealed GameCube hip gear controller as well. He had both of these. There's a PlayStation 2 version, which I don't have, but yeah. I do have an open one of these. Again, if you want to see one of these in action, I recently did a video on the GameCube controller with the built-in screen. These are so cool and so rare and to find two sealed ones, I just, yeah, so awesome. Definitely the uh, like coolest pickup I got this round. 
I'm definitely not opening the GameCube one because I have one opened. I really can't decide if I should open the original Xbox one or not. I feel like I shouldn't and just be patient to find a loose one. But who knows? I'm not a big seal collector. We'll see. Alright, so short but sweet. Those are my pickups this round. Coolest thing definitely for me and favorite would be the Goosebumps and obviously the steeled controllers and even my little PS1 rack back there. Pretty cool. Alright, well that's going to wrap up this video for the recent pickups. Alright, that's going to wrap up today's video. Be sure to follow me on social media. Instagram, the underscore console underscore collector. On Facebook, console collector. On Twitch, console collector. On Twitter, console collector one. And now you can come over to Discord and chat any time of the day. The link is in the description below. Go ahead and check out my other videos. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. I want to thank everybody for watching. I am the console collector. And until the next video, happy gaming.